and a two and a three. You are a genius, aren't you? <laughs> I'm just creative. I'm not a genius. What I'm thinking, and, maybe, have, and you don't it. want that. You just want it to kind of flutter a little. Yeah, yeah. You don't want it to prop, because uh -huh. then you'd have to put a what, what's that little one of those little swivel things. Swivel. Yeah. This is real clickbait. Thanks for clicking on this video and checking it out. We're gonna hopefully catch a pike with this spoon-like lure. I have, as you can tell, a treble hook fixed at the end of it. I'm gonna put a swivel at the top here and make sure to put a leader on it because I lose too many pike if I don't put leaders on and I do not want to lose this lure because it took quite some time, as you can tell, to put it together. I did make a second one just in case, but we're gonna get out on the water and hopefully catch a pike with this lure. See you out there. Oh wait, I'm trying to post a new series coming soon, tips on how to improve your YouTube channel even though mine is very low, but I think I have some tips for you. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. See you on the water. Here we are, let's get it, let's get it. It is 8.30, we have an hour. What's up? Is that Benny? Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hi, crazies. Yeah, you want to use a boat instead? It don't matter to me. I was just going to get on the kayak, but... We'll pull the chairs off. Let's go fishing. Later or regular? I'll have a light. Oh, I thought I got whacked. Thank you. Hopefully it works. I don't know. There you go. <laughs> oh, that's a, is that a pike? Oh no, that's a big, that's a good sized bass. Oh, you wanna bring him around here? Oh, he's get. wow, that is a good one. Yes, sir. Nice. Told you I'd be the first one to catch me. It takes a little while to drop down, I'm noticing, but it's still sinking good. I thought for sure a pike would attack the crap out of this thing. Tommy stocks going on this weekend. Hell yeah. I might run into one of my old girlfriends. <laughs> there we go, I got one. It's a little guy, I think. <laughs> yes, on that on the clickbait arrow. And it's a bass too. Nice one. I gotta land him. You're not a bad one. <laughs> yes. You are a genius, aren't you? <laughs> I'm just creative. I'm not a genius. You know, that could be a million dollar deal. You know? That's awesome. That could be. This lure? Real easy. <laughs> million dollar deal, huh? I gotta make a hundred of them. I actually do need players. It's it's hooked real good. It works. Yep. One and a two and a three. Yeah. I did it. Sweet. It's documented. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, good job, man. It's official. We'll have signed <laughs> official, the documents. Official, yep. That's... Oh, it's starting to like hail. Cigarette slider. Ah! Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it just came out of nowhere. <laughs> oh, we heard it coming. Yeah, we saw it, but I didn't know it was going to be this bad. One fish. I'm going to go out on a different lake next time. I know, I know, it was a short video, but John, Hans, and I only managed to get an hour of fishing in before it started thunderstorming on us. I just got hooked by the clickbait. And I know you probably didn't get a good look at how this thing flutters in the water, but this thing has some crazy action to it. <sighs> One second. Oh, there we go. I didn't get any underwater footage. I plan on doing that in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this video because I thought it was a lot of fun to make. It actually took my dad and I two hours to make this lure and I've actually made it once before. It's nothing crazy, nothing special. It's just a piece of metal I picked up from Home Depot. And I'm going to possibly ship this out to a bigger YouTube channel and challenge them 
to catch a fish on this lure, but I still want to catch a bigger pike on this lure. But if this video gets 50 likes, I'm going to send it to one of the bigger YouTube channels. You can comment below who you recommend, and let's see if we can make it happen. Yeah.